2000 here. We're going to do another episode of Flea Market Finds. Okay, so today, excuse me, this is the first find I got. I got this from Monkey. She had to work and I didn't, so I had her drop me and Bruno off at the flea market because it was kind of in the area where she was at. So, let me straighten this out here a little bit. Now, <clears throat> we got her this cute little jewelry box. I know they make a million of these different kinds of things, but it's got a clock in it. I've got to put a battery in. But I just found this one a little, it's, it was just cute. Got the little drawers that come out around the clock and everything. There's what? Four drawers. Got the little drawer pulls on it. And inside, I can't do this for too long because of, you know. It's got the ballerina in there dancing. A little music box. Now, what else was neat about that is on the instructions here, um, she saw this, you know, of course it always gives you these stupid little instructions, like how to set the clock or whatnot, but on the back of it, it says, I don't want to say a name, but it says a name on it, like blank blank, Dad Died. Viewing Monday morning, funeral Tuesday morning. So, I mean, that's that's pretty weird and kind of sad. You know, it's like something like that being, you know, in something like this, and as pretty as it is. But uh, I, I seen it. And I went over and talked to the guy, and I said, uh, "We got on the." Jewelry box there, guy said 10 bucks, it works and everything. He said the clock needs a battery. But he wound it up, showed me and everything. I was like, hmm, so I was just kind of checking it out, you know, and he says, but I'm thinking seven dollars. And I was like, well, I was thinking eight, but he goes, damn, I always do that. I said, I'll give you the eight. He said, now I'm going to stick by my word. I told you seven. He says, I'll take seven for it. So I got it for seven dollars. So, now that's going to, this, let's take back into Monkey. She did a video on it. Check her video out. Very pretty. All right, so put that in here on the table for her. It's very pretty. Uh, kind of like Oriental-ish, but... So well, I'm walking around, me and Bruno, and I come across this thing sitting there, right up from where I bought the music box. Uh, give me an idea. Just a cheap Poland, Poland Pro, whatever you want to call them. Just a cheap Poland saw. Um, guy said, you know, I don't know if it runs. He said it should. It's got compression, which it does. It's not locked up, but right here. Needs a primer bulb. So we're going to put a, which I happen to have, right here. A little primer bulb. I did a video of putting that primer bulb, putting a primer bulb in my uh, weed eater the other night, but <coughs> turns out the uh, diaphragm and the carburetor is sticking so then uh no not this one let's do the other one first then i got i seen this yep another one let's get you back here a little bit guys maybe you said a little bit more and then another chainsaw that fifty dollars on it but it was 25% off today. It's the estate sale I got this at. Uh, $25 off today, but $50 off tomorrow. I gave him a story about how, which I am about an hour away from him. But uh, and I said I wouldn't be able to make it tomorrow. You know, I asked him if they would honor it. Because I said, you know, these things are cheap anyway, blah, blah, blah. Which it is another Poland product. And... 
He said, well, let me ask. He asked, and he was like, yeah, that's fine, get in on it. Uh, it's a little wet because, you know, it was in the back of the truck a few minutes ago, and it started raining, so I had to run out and get him out of the back of the truck. But, but yeah. It comes with the... There's some oil in there. The, uh... You know, the guide, whatever you want to call it, owner's manual. This one is the Blackhawk, which is a Poland product. But as you can see down here as well, it has a, uh, it needs a permabolt. So there's that one, okay? Now, no oil in them jugs, but let's close this up. Let me sit you down. And let's get item, my item. <laughs> Show you her item. Get my item number three here. All right. Get you opened up here. Now this one does have oil in it in the jug. Bar chain oil. And this one, they have $50 on. Let's get this out of here. Again, the water from being out in the truck when it started raining. So that's, you know, of course it's got the oil in it. Or, you know, oil and junk. People never clean their things out. Okay, like I said they had fifty dollars on this one. A little pulling. Uh this one, the primer bulb is good so far. So we're gonna try to start this here in a few minutes. The other two, I don't know if it'll start yet. That'll be another video changing primer bulbs in them. But, I'm not sure what this is for. But, anyway, there it is. This is the model, uh, it's a 38cc. What is that? 3816? What is that? 38. I don't know. I don't have my glasses on. So, anyway, there's that. Um, Again, here we go. I get squirrel. Anyway, get sidetracked real easy. Fifty dollars on it. Has some state on it, and they said, "Well, this is a pretty nice one. We're pretty sure it'll run." I'm like, all right, whatever. What do you want for it? They said thirty-five dollars. So I gave them thirty-five dollars for that one. Which this one we're going to try to start here in a few minutes. I got a little fuel over here and mixed up, and we'll put a little in it and see where where it goes from there. So stick with me, and I'll be right back with you guys. Hopefully, this thing will run, and we'll do our closing thoughts. So hang tight. Be right back. All right, guys. Here we go. So I noticed when I pumped that bulb a few minutes ago when I shown it to you, there were some a little bit of fuel up in there in the bulb so what the hell right let's give this a shot uh, switch on choke it there it is Stay tuned. 
actually cause sometime this weekend, I don't know about the day it's raining, but the truck over there uh, needs a master cylinder. The brakes feel a little soft, so we're gonna do that. I'm gonna videotape that. The master cylinder itself, everybody, it's two lines, one plug, and uh, two bolts, but the main thing of those is getting it bled out properly. That's the main thing I want to show you on that. So, that being said, there's my uh, flea market finds for this time, and uh, stay tuned for another video on some primer bulbs. I got a primer bulb. Like I said, I put my weed eater right here. It's a Bowens, but uh, what you did run, it's just not pumping the fuel up right. So I ordered a whole carburetor for it. It was like 15 bucks. I got nothing in it. It was given to me. So, and these things, like I said, I got 10, 25. So that's what, 35 and 35 dollars. So I got 70 bucks and three chains. So I'm pretty confident the other two will run. Um, so not like I said they're all pretty much the same brand I can interchange stuff do this and that to make something work and make a few dollars not going to get rich off of them because it's not like it's a steel chainsaw or you know anything home light or anything like that there's palm pro you can buy them brand new for 119 125 dollars whatnot you know depending I know let's not get split hairs but you can buy brand new online you can buy brand new but uh season's coming up so I figure I should be able to get you know, about 60 on that one, maybe 50 on the other two if they run properly. So I'll be able to make a couple bucks. But the fun part for me is getting them running like that. I didn't have to do a damn thing to it. Cool. $35. Can't beat it. So anyway, remember, check out Monkey 1000, guys. And that being said, I'm going to say bye-bye for now. Remember, Shea Bear, the myth, the man, the legend. Enjoy the rest of your weekend and have a better week coming. So I will see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye now. Take care.